This ghost town is anything but deserted. It's actually full of your favorite and most delicious brews. If you're looking for a spooky good time, Ghost Town Brewing is bringing the hops this Halloween. Joining me now are Trevor Morris and Noah Shusit from Ghost Town Brewing. Noah, Trevor, thank you both so much for joining us here on Live in the Bay. Yeah, thank you so much for having thank us. Thank you for having us. Very excited to be here. Yeah, we are so excited that you are here as well. And to all of our viewers who may not know, who is Ghost Town Brewing? Yeah, uh, Ghost Town is a small local company from Oakland. We're about 30 to 40 people. Um, but mainly, we uh, were started 10 years ago by four homebrew enthusiasts who also were fans of, participants in, and creators of the local metal music scene. And they kind of combined their two loves into a delicious beer brand. And yeah. now here we are. So yeah. it's funny because from the outside looking in, when we see some of these designs and hear the name, people may think it's just associated with Halloween, but it's actually more associated with the rock scene, right? Yeah, much more associated with uh, metal, and they kind of capture their, you know, that whole vibe with the artwork on there. It definitely stands out. Uh, a little bit different labels than a lot of craft beer you'll see in stores. Um, but that's kind of what Ghost Town is, is, a collection of unique people mm -hmm. and, uh, you know, make good beer. Yeah. Unique people, unique flavors. Yeah. You guys actually have a new brew each and every week, which a lot of breweries don't do. Correct. Yeah, we are a fresh beer brand where every week uh, Trevor's team of brewers um, and my team on the sales and distribution team, we are brewing or distributing a fresh beer every single week. The styles are generally the same, um, but every week, whether you're grabbing a four pack off your local market or asking for a pull off your local tap, you're gonna have whatever style you like, you're gonna have something fresh mm -hmm. and delicious. Yeah. Fresh take. options, yeah. you know, Every trying our best to get fresh, good hop aroma to everyone out there. Well, yeah. you guys are absolutely doing that, and I can't taste one of these beers, which we're going to do in a second, <laughs> without first acknowledging this incredible artwork. What goes into the artwork each and every week? Uh, well, our artwork, we have a network of various artists that we use. Our uh, owner actually does most of the, uh, the labels himself. One of our other owners does some digital artwork for some of them. Uh, some of them are also just public domain art that is used, and then um, we also have like local employees of our company that make art for it. This uh, can for here example, yeah. was done by one of our beer tenders uh, who works at the West Oakland Tap Room. She uh, drew it all up, and her owner got it on there. So, ah, oh, so cool! I love the theme that you have going here. Well, let's taste some of these beers. Let's taste two of them actually, because there's too many on here for us to taste <laughs> all of them. But your top two. Walk me through them. Pour us all a sip, and then we can talk about them. Yeah, well, I'd say let's start with the, uh, this is a West Coast Pilsner here. Uh, it's fermented with lager yeast, which is a little different than usually how you do it, and then it's dry hopped uh, like a pale ale. Mm -hmm. uh, and we find our house strain of lager yeast um, accentuates the hops, uh, especially New Zealand hops. So this has uh, nectaron, which is a hop from New Zealand in there, and it gives it a nice citrus flavor, uh, mm -hmm. some blood orange, some uh, mandarin, uh, some lemon. So Sounds good. Let's crack it open. Light beer. I'd like to try this one. I'm a big hop fan. And this is going to be right up your alley because not only will it have robust hop flavor, Perfect. but limb from limb is a lower ABV at 5.3%. And being that it is a lager, it's not going to hit you in the face. It's yeah. just going to have an excellent fa flavor that's going to be, it's going to fall right off. Well, let's yeah. cheers, fellas. Let's try this one, this first one here. Cheers. cheers. Happy Halloween. Cheers. Happy Halloween, everybody. Mm. You, so first and foremost, you can smell the hops before you taste them. Not too heavy, though. Sometimes hops can be overpowering, but I like how you mentioned the citrusy flavors. That's really delicious. Yeah, well, nice and light, not too bitter. You know, yes, kind of leaves exactly. you wanting another sip. It's refreshing. Yeah, well, actually, with another slip, sip, let's actually taste this second one. And while we do that, Noah, I would love to know about some of the things going on at Ghost Town Brewing. Yeah. What can people look forward to? Yeah, yeah. Well, uh, we operate two locations. Uh, uh, we brew, package, and deliver everything out of our West Oakland location that also mm -hmm. has a full tasting room and rotating food trucks uh, five to seven days a week. Mm -hmm. uh, in East Oakland at 35th and West MacArthur, we we have a second tasting room that has a full kitchen attached to it as well. So beyond all of the hard work that my my coworkers and Trevor's coworkers and everybody's doing at the breweries, we also do have some fun. We have a monthly drink and draw event. We have uh, costume karaoke. Recently, we've been which would be perfect, right? For Halloween, it's really fun when you're working late at night and you hear people belting out uh, various songs. I can only imagine. <laughs> Lots of screaming going on, but yeah. there's always something uh, good to check out. You can find these on our Instagram at, at ghosttownbrewing.com is where we'll list those as well. All right, well, let's cheers, fella, fellas, and then uh, cheers. while we drink this one, 
Ooh, I think I might that like was... that one even more. That one is super <laughs> light, very tasty. That was fantastic. That was actually our hazy IPA release that uh, was canned about an hour ago. So yeah. Oh, I just an hour here. ago. Yeah. Fresh for live in the yeah, bed. Yeah, exactly. Indeed. Grabbed Indeed. it right off the canning line uh, as I was leaving the brewery this morning to come over here. So. Incredible. Well, you guys also have received some awards for your brewing, right? Yes. Uh, and I want to point out that Trevor and his team, each one, when I congratulated them to a team, first said uh, this was a team win. But we've long at Ghost Town Brewing thought that Trevor, Justin, Austin, Shelly, Steve, Tim, that they are some of the best in the game in the country. And recently at the Great American Beer Festival, it wasn't just us uh, patting them on the back for their excellent work. We won a silver medal for a West Coast Pilsner, which was the Same first style, style which is of beer this we one, had. Right? Okay. It's not this specific beer, but it is a specific Similar. style. Yeah. Same style. We won a silver there. We won a gold medal um, in the American uh, Strong Palo category for Mordant, which is one of our IPAs. One uh, of our rotating ones. That one gets brought back usually two to three times a year. Uh, oh, okay. Very interval. So people love here. that one. Yeah. yeah they it do. is one of our better sellers. And, and then one of our most popular beers, uh, the Nose Goblin, is an Imperial or a double IPA. Um, that won a gold medal as well. And it actually won a gold medal last year, too. It's been a couple decades since one double IPA repeated back to back. Um, and then, as our team in Denver a few weeks ago was all excited, waiting to get on stage to get their medals, it was announced that we won uh, Brewer of the Year for our size facility, wow, which is. Congratulations. Thank you. It was a very prestigious very award. Yes, yeah. that's so exciting. <laughs> and you should be so proud of the products that you guys have put out. Well, thank you so much, Trevor. Yeah. No, we appreciate you joining us here on Live in the Bay. Thanks thank for, you having, for us. having us. Happy Halloween. <laughs> to learn more about Ghost Town Brewing or to check out one of their tap rooms for yourself, we'll have a link on our website at liveinthebay.tv.